Gonna puke? soon. The Raffins left are crooked as a bag of snakes. Did you sleep all right? Can't complain. And you? Reasonably rested? I think you had nightmares. You screamed a few times. Really? Don't worry. I'm accustomed to that sort of thing. When Mitch and Scorpion came back from the war, they tossed and turned night after night. For months this went on. Whatever it is, It'll pass. Yeah, let's hope so. Come up with anything? For Hellman, I mean. As a matter of fact, I did. Look here. Okay, tell me. We're the wrench. The cutter is the AV. And the screwdriver is where the AV should bury its nose cone in the dust. Now, you must be wondering how we get the AV to do that. That old HMG of yours. My gun will be useful elsewhere. This caliber would barely dent the armor of a heavy hitter like that. There are other ways. Here, the clamps are solution. A sat wave power station. Why down the AV there, at that exact spot? Because once it's on the ground, we'll have to locate it and grab your target. As fast as we can. And the terrain there is typical California desert. Flat, dry, and empty. They'll be a big old sitting duck. Power station. Wait. You want to use an EMP? Bullseye. But how? We can't generate that sort of pulse on command. Would you like to bet me? We drive up to the power collection unit, break in and override the controls, lift any limiters. As soon as the AV is in range, we set off the electromagnetic turbo pulse. This should smoke the AV system. So the drive. Nav systems. Communications. Everything. Out like a light. They won't stand a chance in hell. Remember, need Hellman alive, unharmed. Gotta try not to blow the AV to bits, okay? I know. But I'd say your man had best be buckled in. This idea, if it works, you'll be in for a rough landing. Aren't you, uh, counting chickens? We can't actually know the AV will fly over the station. Of course we can, but we don't have to. You'll see. It's bound to be quite a ride, but not one you'll regret. I've got everything planned out. All right, let's ride. Great, hop in. It's cold out here. Who owns this power station? Gov or Corp? Is there any difference? Who do you think pulls the government's strings? Hey, I'm just wondering whose toes we're about to step all over. V, look around. It is simple. Everything you see is owned by a corporation. And now for something completely different. Weirdest thing you've ever transported. Go. What? Are we playing 20 questions? Come on, answer. The deputy finance director of Kaukaz. That's chauffeuring, not smuggling. He rode in the trunk. Flatlined. Really? Dead? A long story. Maybe someday I'll tell you. You like to mess with the corpse, huh? Whatever gave you that idea. Or wait. Scratch that. Rogue, Nash, the Raffins. You're on thin ice, B. You just like to mess with everyone. Well, then I suppose it's a good thing I'm on your side, isn't it? Mm-hmm.
We've almost reached the dam. We'll make a quick stop here. We need to calibrate you with a turret. I want you to be able to use the gun, too. It should up our chances in general. Connect here. Do we really have to waste our time on this? We do. Unless you've already used one of these without help, while moving, while taking fire from all directions, and still managed to hit something. But somehow, I don't believe that's the case. So don't argue. Just connect. How should I connect? Personal link? How else? Just watch the jack. Sometimes you have to jig a little bit. Wired in. Wait a moment. Diagnostics first. Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh, I think your implant has a virus. The one in the nape of your neck. Uh, I've got a bioprocessor in my head that operates independently of me. Probably why your diagnostics flagged it. Mm-hmm. Okay. But no data will leak out of it through the personal link. Your ride's secure. Fine. I trust you won't fuck anything up. Okay. Here goes nothing. See that pile of junk? Fire a short burst into it. I'll take care of the calibration. Good. Next target. Single shot. Okay. Just one more. Longer round. Great. We're done, I think. Now that wasn't so bad, was it? Calibration's fine, but your soft could really use an update. Scanner, controllers, all a couple of generations back Hey, if you'd back, rather daydream, least. please wait until we're done calibrating. It's better tech in the bargain bin at a kabuki flea market. I can help you with that, you know. Yes, sure. The most important thing is that it works now. So where's this power station? You will see in a moment. I know a spot. We'll have a decent view from there. I just want to be sure the area is clear. Sabotage a corpo power station. Jump a corpo transport. Kidnap a corpo suit. Is this a plug for the word corpo, or do you have a point? Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Hmm. Maybe we can just get along. Could be something to that, I suppose. What happened to us, it must have had some effect. You're more like me than you think. You'll see. But it goes both ways. Maybe you're becoming more like me. Nah, no way. All looks clear. The area looks deserted. I see no patrols. The huge thing is the collection unit. And see the antennas? Each antenna collects microwave energy from satellites in orbit. That's then converted into electric power. Power stations serve the whole city? Honestly? Who the fuck knows? Guess we're about to find out. Antennas run a ways down the interstate. We set off a chain reaction that starts in the collection unit. Then each antenna will emit a massive EMP burst. While our AV flies right into our net. We just have to send out the pulse at the right moment. Let's go get her. When we arrive at the station, you overload the systems. I'll set up a bypass link for the detonator. Why don't I start with the transformers? Make mayhem in the relative voltages. Rest should move faster after that. Not a bad idea. That's just... Yeah, yeah, I know, the converters. But they shouldn't be a problem. I'll just crank everything up past max. Seems we think alike. So what now? We wait. We should time our arrival to the AV flight. Got it. Good. Time to roll. Done anything like this before? Downing an AV? By myself? No. Why do you ask? 
Power station, EMP, the systems, networks. Came up with a really solid plan. Thank you. How you approach things, that's the trick. Mine is the AAA. Wait, what now? Assessment, assembly, action. Whatever your task, you do three things. Start by assessing what you already have and what you'll face, the problem. Then you plan with those variables in mind. Take what you have, get what you need, assemble things, people. Finally, you take action. Simple. Got one word for you. T-shirts. Triple A. It's all you need to lead the good life. That and the occasional cold beer. Your method, Triple A. That all you? <laughs> Not at all. I learned it from the Elder Caldos. Mitch and Scorpion. They were trained in something like it during the war. Then they made it their own. It's come in handy, I can't deny. And it will again now. What if, uh, something goes ass up? Well, then your ass had better improvise. Did you really think I'd just give you a foolproof secret to success? Gotta say, almost had me believe in just that. You're too much sometimes, V. Okay, we'll be there in a moment. One last time. We drive in, fuck up the system, and get the hell out of there. Hold on tight. This could get a little bumpy. Get ready. Okay, I'm ready. before something happens to the chimp. Answer the tip. You know, I was just about to set up a picnic. Maybe lay out, work on I my mean, best hand. Watch out, the next one might. Johnny? Johnny? Fucking hell. Okay, I'm fine. It's, it's okay, just. It's okay, I'm fine, yeah. Just... Delta the fuck out. Not the cleanest job, perhaps, but it still went well. What about the detonator? Is it working? Yes, it's working. And I don't even see a drop in the signal strength. We just need to drive far away enough to keep the pulse from blasting us, too. The cliff there. We'll set up. It should give us a good view of the antennas. And then we wait. Okay. I always wanted to push the big red button on something like this. How do we know when? Don't worry, I'll have eyes on it. You just wait for my signal, then set off that pulse. They won't know what hit them. And by the way... What? We are about to knock a multi-million euro dollar Kang Tao asset clean out of the sky. How does that make you feel? Blasted shit. Exactly what the doc ordered. And that's exactly what I like to hear. Just noticed. What? It's quiet. 
The hum of the city, people's voices, the smells. It's all gone. Wind just intensifies it. I think I forgot quiet exists. Mm-hmm. Though maybe not the smells. I mean, the coyotes. Rather hard to miss. Thought that was just the air freshener in your Thornton. Ha ha. Screw you. You'd do better to focus on the AV. Keep your eyes open. It's there. Coming from Pacifica. All right. Get ready. One more second. One more. Now! Boom. There she is. Shit! What's happening? Fuck! Great. Just great. Bullseye! Pan Am, the engines are still running. Fuck, they're getting away. They're going nowhere. We gotta go after it. Give me a moment. Pan Am, what are you doing? Altitude. We got the bastard. Let's go. We got it. No way it stays in the air after a blast like that. We either land or crash. You catch that? Yep. Over. AV on March. Losing out. Fish. There. Scorpion. What the hell is Finishing up at the generators. Follow them. On my way in a bit. Battery Mitch, should sort Scorpion, itself out. It's Pan Am. Don't go near that AV. I repeat, do not approach the AV. Mm -hmm. On the way, or I'll start the party without you. It's Kang Tao! Wait for me! Or better, get the hell out! They probably want to help the survivors, without knowing it's corporate. They can't hear me! The pulse is interfering! Shit! I have three on radar! Drones? Yes, get ready. They're trying to slow us down! We won't let them! We have to reach with the Scorpion! That hill. Well, one less thing to worry about. Pan Am, you okay? The fucking ricochet. Think you can manage? Sure. I'll live. Don't worry. Hey, man, where are you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Scorpion. Keep broadcasting over an open channel, just in case they missed you the first time. God, I swear. Something's not right. Did you hear those shots? Fee, something happened to them. Let's check it out. I see the wreck, but no scorpion or Mitch. Looks expired. Fuck it. V, connect to the drone. We'll scan the area. We have to get our bearings. They won't mark us? I'll enable the masking. Their scanners are out. They're blind. Let's roll. You connecting to visual? Mm-hmm. V, if they got the Alticaldus, if they got Mitch and Scorpion, I can't... I don't... I know, I know. Connected. I'm in control.
Oh no, no, no. Sorry. The clan? All the Kelvins. Yes. They're dead. All of them. Mitch! He's alive! They have them! If they... Don't worry. We don't know for sure. They've set up the launcher. They'll tear us to shreds if we get too close. Can't we take it down somehow? Maybe. But we have to get there first. Five Kangs on patrol. Combat drones. Defense system is active. This a... If not for those damned glitches, I could have warned them! This is all my doing! Why in the hell were they following the AV? The fools! Listen, we saw Mitch. They probably got Scorpion too. We'll find them. Help them out. If they're still alive. They're alive. Everything's gonna be okay. Mind that launcher. It will blow us to bits if we approach. Okay, here's the plan. You stay in the car, No, I... not so fast. I will go with you. Those are my people. Pan Am. Hate to break it to you, but you're hurt. Wait in the car. I'll try and take out the launcher. I... Fine. But I have Mitch's rifle. And we'll try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move.
Path's clear. I'm coming for you. for everyone to walk out of this alive. We called for backup! Bullshit! Last chance. You don't gotta die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am. Shoot Shut him. up. Listen. This isn't about you. Let him go and tell me where I... your passenger is. I, I don't know where they took him. Hell no. He's lying. You don't know or you don't want to say. Let me get the comms back up. I'll bust the unit. We'll talk. Pan Am. But only if you remember the Shut cowboy, the fuck don't up. you? God damn it! Oh shit. Are you alright? Uh, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on, girl. I'll patch it's you up. Nothing. Let's go. We couldn't retreat, Pan Am. They regrouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorpion, is he here? Mitch? Mitch! He's... He's safe, Pan right? Am, I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No! No! Are you sure? No, he... Scorpion, the rest. I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. I should have stopped him. I tried. He wouldn't have listened to you either. Never was much of a listener. Stubborn bastard. I'm guessing since you were out here, you were out here for the AV. The question is why? Everything okay? You need anything? Thanks for saving my ass, V. Sorry about your people, but I need to keep moving. Why dive straight for the AV? Didn't notice the markings? We saw it was damaged. We know this land. We knew where it would fall. We had no idea it was Kang Tao. I figured they might need help. In the worst case, there'd be good salvage to be had. Couldn't have been more wrong. I need the guy who's riding this AV. You know anything. See anything. Took him with him. In our cars. Where? West. Small unit. Your passenger's entourage. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but... ...couldn't connect. If they took your cars, we might be able to follow their tracks. I'll go after him. Stay with Mitch, I'll be fine. I'm going with you. I promised I would help. Besides, those bastards killed Scorpion. I won't let that go. Don't argue with her, V. No point. Go. I'll call my people. We'll take care of things here. We'll leave my ride here just in case. Just watch the gun, it likes to jam. We'll go by bike. Sounds solid. Kang Tao lost contact with their AV. Probably looking for it. Better hurry. But Pan Am... What? You're coming back for her, right? I promise. Let's get going, before they send a rescue party. Scorpion and the rest. Look, I know how you feel. I mean it. I'll help you settle your score with Kang Tao. I will destroy them, V. Every last one. We're in this together. To the bitter end. You know what, V? You're all right. You helped me with Nash. You helped me with Mitch. To my mind, I owe you a favor. Your Hellman. I will find him. Ah, so that's what this is? Just paying your debts? No. Nomads always hunt Oh, own. so I'm one of yours now. Sounds good. Let's ride. 
Hope they didn't go far. We'll see. The tire tracks start there. We'll follow them. Our guys were here. See them? Let's follow. Find them. Scorpion said I would hate Night City. He knew you that well. Probably better than I know myself. He said when I'd had enough of the city, we would stock up on canned kibble, fill a couple of thermoses with coffee and whiskey, and hit the road. He said we would get away from it all. Sounds like a real adventure. Yeah. But he's gone. Shit, V. Why is everything shit, shit, shit? Hey, I know. Look. You're alive. Still got a few things to take care of, too. Mm-hmm. You know it. is cracked concrete and rust. If they thought they would call their friends, they were in for one hell of a surprise. Careful, V.
No unwanted attention. Directions to take a helmet with them. If they manage to re that's all of them. Better hurry then. That's one of our one of their what? Let's check it. Dunno if we'll find anything else here. Enough. There's nobody here. Better check where Kang Tao took him. Fast. You were right. Nomad's car did die. They tried to put her back on her feet, but the oil pump died. Pistons couldn't take it. Gave us a few minutes, maybe, but they still got a head start. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with Hellman. They're coming for him, don't worry. Do you know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit, only to trip into another bigger one. Pan Am. And pull in everyone else after me. I'm done. You hear me, B? I fuck up again, you better give me a good kick in the ass. But you didn't fuck any... Promise me! All right, I promise.
These tracks lead up past the hill to an old filling station. I wager that's where they're holding helmets. Is there no end to this madness? Surrender!
Come out! Hands where I can see them! I'm in. Helmet, he has to be here. Keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay. Covering you.
Who sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back home? Pathetic rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. Seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Helmet, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Helmet. Alive? What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like your new Chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder colors. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Jeez, long story. Not sure I'd even know where to start. Tell me next time, then. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope it was worth it. That's all I tried to raise, Scorpio. Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Saul. It really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure, right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing. My fault that AV got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're in Aldo Caldo, you were always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still in Aldo Caldo. Damn it all. Hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pat. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but you're family, and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is. Am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you. You look out for yourself, all right? So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I have to sit and think about everything. Saul, Mitch, they really treat you like family. Maybe you should give them a chance. It is not that simple. Like any family. They're coming. You have about a minute to get out of there. Let's move! I'm also headed out. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours.
Hey. Where am I? What is this place? Motel, middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Wanna talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for our soccer. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. You misunderstand me. There is no offer. What do you want? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy, and I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that, none of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the fine print. Constructed, that's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clepped it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out of And drive. you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My Ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was down in a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware. Aggressive? The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arisaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Looks like... Can't believe this suit's the one who's gonna help us. Oh, fuck. Impressive, isn't it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. 
The only thing I could do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time. ...is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against this. And no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny... Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. Know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Because, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. I'll try. Just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese. At my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. What a half-brain gonk. He just admitted Get you're right. Out. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. He... Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. than nothing, long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. What'll you do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is absolutely parched. <coughs> See that? Fuck me. Just look at that. Unacceptable. Inhumane. Sons of bitches. You really 
are paranoid. You don't see it? Way corpse are stripping our world and lives naked, piece by piece? Can't turn a blind eye to that. This is the part where you divulge your master plan to annihilate Arasaka? No. It's the part where I say I despise petty merc thieves who think they're hot shit rebels after setting foot in the afterlife. Might think you took on Arasaka, but you're just a bug they scraped off the sole of their boot and tossed in the trash. Ain't the only one to get flatlined by Sokka. Except I didn't let him scoop out my mind. Did you lock it in a trinket? Huh. I brought war to their doorstep, kid. Your grand plan? To steal their fucking car. You're a dick, you know. And you're a cunt. Maybe we'll fit together after all. You seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seen flashes of your past. Just like you've seen flashes of mine. Honestly, I'm scared of the day I'll start seeing your memories as my own. Shit. If it's a two-way street, I'll somehow have to live with the fact that I let Deshaun best me. Fuck me over. How you find life under my skin? Well... Most things are either too big or too small. Not to mention the clusterfuck that are your hormones. And the lag between sight and touch. Infuriating. When you take a bite of pizza, it takes ages before I know you fucking burn the roof of your mouth. Plus, used to be five minutes wouldn't pass before I had a fresh cig in my hand. Now I'm itching for nicotine. Getting used to it, I guess. But it's no fucking picnic. So, listen, will, will I notice a change, or is it one of those things where I wonder why I ever feared it? Worst thing you can do to a human, rip their identity out of them. That's all I know. Can you just tell me what you want? What you really want? Help me settle my score against Arasaka. That's it. Let's get out of here. Your goal is to bury Arasaka. Demolish it. Mine's to stay above ground. Seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually align pretty nicely, too. You need Mikoshi to save your life? That done, I can burn it to the ground. There it is. The Crusade. Get to Mikoshi, smash the system. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corps have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. Might be right. Can't really argue with you there. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Johnny, fuck take hell. a sec. We got it. You still don't see it, but you will one Johnny. day.
Hello, we haven't met. I'm Elizabeth. My husband and I, we need a somewhat delicate matter handled. We think you could help. My am I asking who your husband is? Actually, who are you? I'd rather not discuss details over the phone. Please, meet with us. We'll explain everything. As I said, it's a rather delicate matter. What's so delicate about the matter? I'd rather discuss that in person, if you don't mind. Can we meet? Sure, let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. V, how you doing, honey? Listen, got a golden opportunity for you. Word on the streets that when Waco says golden, it's usually a turd wrapped in crepe paper. It's a sticky situation. Sticky? Wow, you're really selling this, Waco. Jobs like any other. Just the clients will demanding. Clients got every right to be demanding. What makes this one any different? Wants everything to go exactly as planned. Willing to break the bank for it, too. Job like this needs your magic touch, V. Anyone less experienced it, just fuck it up. Huh. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Now I'm sure it's a turd in crate paper. So what's the spec? The NCPD advises those traveling beyond official police jurisdiction to wear a bulletproof vest at all times. Want me to murder someone? Wait, this isn't the Dalai Lama. Must have gotten the wrong number. You didn't arrive in this pond yesterday, V. You know how the fish gets sliced. The perp being proven guilty, meaning he deserves to die truly. Do I look like a criminal prosecutor to you? What did he do exactly? I'm not a beat reporter, neither. You want the job or not? All right, I'm in. Good. Client will be waiting for you by a car at the corner of 6th and Brandon. Huh, in a car? Client wants to tag along. Be there in person when you put a bullet through the guy's eye. Good luck. Okay. Hello, V. I'm Jefferson Perales. You've already spoken with Elizabeth, my wife. Perales? <laughs> the one running for mayor of Night City. The one? So the one who was DA until recently, but just vaulted into a seat on the city council. I gather you now understand why discretion is of the utmost importance. Nice to meet you, Mr. Perales. Mrs. Perales. Hmm, right again, Liz. You see, my wife is a great judge of character. Said this would work. Now I see why. So, what do you got for me? Carter, let's go. Elizabeth? Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Ryan recently passed. We want to know how, why, whatever else is pertinent. all over the news. Of course it was. Media feasted for weeks. Pieces like that are their lifeblood. Right. Think they missed something? We have reason to believe they did, yes. As far as I remember, someone tried to zero Ryan a few days before his death. The NCPD sees no link. They're saying it was a random cyber-psycho attack. They claim the mayor died of natural causes. Causes unrelated to the attack. It's in the official reports. Ryan died at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. These suspicions of yours wouldn't have anything to do with the upcoming election, would they? Of course they would. If Lucius Ryan was murdered, we want to know. Need to know. What makes you think the cops got it wrong? 
Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today, or a lot of people will be in a lot of trouble. If you agree to help, you can see it right now. Where'd you get the scroll? Ryan was making a public appearance. BD scrolling standard procedure for events like that. Following the attack, the NCPD impounded the footage as evidence. We had to pull many strings to extract it. All right, see what I can do. Excellent. We'd be happy with any find that would clarify things, alleviate lingering doubts. Well, what do we got here? Question is, what are you doing here? My brain too, isn't it? And this time, don't go scrolling every ass you see. Eyes on the mayor. Stuff belongs to City Hall. Let Make it PG. Who's the Hulk guy? No idea. Those ass clowns are all the same. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Gotta practice. Red Queen's race? Cause any inner synapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting, Off with their heads! You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. They left literally seconds before the attack. And it looks planned. Like it was done on purpose. That or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. Stop right there.
Slow your roll. River Ward, NCBD. Police. Stop right there! Slow your roll! Rip. Reward, NCBD. Let him in? Let him wait. It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Prem, do it after the conference. City with what he was packing. Probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels in an ugly ass suit. Know that? We're just talking out your ass again. Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. Do it after the conference. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butt. The tune. Don't recognize it. Tune? What he's humming. Wouldn't call that a tune. He's really into it. right as he went through the gate. Yeah, glitch is no accident. Nah, seen stranger coincidences. Like? 
Like when you bang some chick and then her sister later, same night. And it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah. But it could have. Well, well, well. <laughs> Fantastic. So, any thoughts? Did you uh, see anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? I, I understand. We'll catch up soon. As you were saying. You're here. Fantastic. Did you uh, see anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? Whole thing stinks worse than Coronado Bay in July. Huh. So suspicions confirmed. Any questions at this point? Conference. Why was it held? For no particular reason. Ryan liked the sound of his voice and seeing himself on TV. Yeah, that sort of thing. As far as I recall, the drop at Night City's violent crime rate was the excuse for this one. Ryan came out to tout it. <laughs> Sorry, drop. Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent district. Stats for that part of town stopped counting. <laughs> Clever. Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy, and his bulldog, so to speak. Running in Ryan's place now. Red Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him? I'll put you in touch. Anyone else besides Ryan's detail have access to the terminal? Hmm. NCPD. That's it. Mayor's Hustle. The NCPD? No. All handpicked by Holt. And on a corpse payroll. But there are ex-cops among them. Sheesh. What a great timing. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. Sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. 